guys, this is Laurel of The Dabbling Hook. I am here to do the holidays tr holiday traditions tag. I was tagged by Miss Melanie, uh, formerly of Melanie's Stitch to My Lou, who is now um, the way I see it. Nice play on word there. Um, okay, so I was actually in my car on my way home yesterday when I was listening to you and then to Debbie and I've seen, I've since seen um, Z's as well. Um, so mine is going to be pretty boring. Um, while I was listening to you guys on the drive, I was just realizing we really don't have any traditions. At least I don't think so. So um, here goes. Hopefully, well, I'm plugged in. So hopefully the last debacle with the last video and the volume doesn't repeat itself. And I have this weird setup here so well I'll know I guess when I when I'm editing if it works or not anyway question number one when do you decorate for the holidays well <sighs> when do we decorate <clears throat> excuse me it is now what a few days after a week jeez a week after Thanksgiving and we still don't have our tree up yet I think we used to do it honestly I don't remember um, I don't remember growing up when we did it and um because we were never really into the big christmas decoration like it is here coming from the caribbean there wasn't all that um i'm sure it is now because we've been gone um decades but growing up there wasn't any of that and um growing up here we didn't really get into it you know everyone got gathered for christmas but um there was no big to do and all the decoration and all so Personally, um, I think I used to do it around um, right after Thanksgiving, but as the kids get older, they are less and less interested. They're more interested in what they're going to get. So they're, um, they're helping less and less. And I was just mentioning it to Minion 2, and he corrected me that he helped last year, which means he probably put about two or three um, ornaments on and then took off. So right now, this is a week after Thanksgiving, and um, they've just taken down all this stuff from where it's stored. I'm waiting, because uh, my husband said that he and the boys are going to decorate. I have a craft fair on Saturday, so supposedly they're going to do it. Long, long answer for such a, short, such a short question. Usually sometime after Thanksgiving. Who knows? I think last year it was like already December before I put it up. What style do you decorate in? Um, I like more on the traditional side, not fully traditional, but I like the reds and the golds. It's the only place I really like, you know, gold decorations. Um, traditional, but simple traditional as well. I don't get all glam and all that. In my head though, I do have an idea of what I would like it to be. There is um, someone I follow on Instagram. Um, her name is Priscilla. She, when I first started, she used to um, crochet, but now she's totally into the cross stitching and she does it with her daughter. But when I first started following her, she used to decorate like nobody's business. She has multiple Christmas trees and they're decorated differently. Um, I even call her Martha, as in Martha Stewart, because she is awesome at it. So anyway, um, my style, traditional, um, but I don't like the colored lights though. I like just the plain white light. So I've told my husband that we can alternate every year. So it's not all about me. <laughs> what is my favorite Christmas tradition? Like I said, we really don't have traditions. I guess it's just us getting together. Well, growing up um, for Thanksgiving and holidays um, on my father's side, everyone used to get together. Um, and there would be like, you know, everyone would bring food, we'd eat, and then the men would go play dominoes and we got to stay up late, I guess. That's sort of tradition, but that's long since gone. So I really don't have much. Now we do Christmas Eve with the in-laws and then we go to my family um, on Christmas day. So I guess that's it. Uh, what is your favorite place to buy holiday decor? I think a few people have said it, whatever is cheap and usually after the holidays I go buy, but Lately, I haven't been, lately as in the last few years, I haven't been too into the holiday decor. So whatever's on sale and whatever that catches my eye, wherever it's cheaper, even the dollar store, because you guys have seen on, on YouTube, right? The, the people who do Dollar Tree decorating. Awesome. 
I don't have that kind of um, what's the word I don't have that kind of um, uh, decorator bone in my body I guess what is my favorite holiday movie hmm the only one that comes to mind Scrooged with Bill Murray but other than that um, don't laugh but I've never watched a Christmas story I've seen clips I know about the tongue on the cold pole and out and I just haven't I've never watched it so sorry <laughs> um, eggnog hot chocolate or apple cider hot chocolate eggnog I don't like the taste of eggnog um, it doesn't have enough flavor for me apple cider is okay if you put red wine in Garen um, but I like hot chocolate especially on a cold day it hits the spot no um, uh, what are those no marshmallows though <laughs> and I'm lactose intolerant but if I could um, handle it I'd add extra cream in my hot chocolate just saying uh, do I leave cookies out for Santa I've never done that um, so no <laughs> it's never been a thing for us um, real or artificial tree artificial so we've had um, my husband my boyfriend at the time when we first moved in together we had a real tree it was a small one and then uh, when we first bought our first house we had a real tree and um, I remember when it was all dried and ready to get rid of it we were taking it out and it got caught in a doorway can you guess what happened pine needles went everywhere I swear for like a year after we were still finding them in places like you moved a fridge or something and you were finding pine Ugh, I can't I can't do it so it's it's artificial I have a eh one because um, the kids even my husband they really haven't been all that gung-ho about decorating and doing all that but I really want to get a nice full um, big one even one of those flocked ones with the it looks like it has snow on it but not yet I want to see how they do decorating the tree this Saturday um, what is my favorite holiday dessert so I make I think a killer bread pudding not like the bread pudding when you go to, to a restaurant and they have bread pudding yeah no mine is one it's not for a dieter because it's got no fat free no whatever nothing light in there and growing up my mom used to use stale bread to make bread pudding I use fresh baguette I use full cream I use butter on oh, the house I can smell it now the house smells amazing so I only make it from November through December because like I said it's not for a dieter so it will do some damage I actually haven't made any at all this month so um, starting next month for a few weeks I will be making some maybe once a week my mother-in-law has a sweet tooth and she loves it as well sometimes I make my own um, caramel sauce for it and sometimes I just buy it but my bread pudding that's mine other than that um, oh we have um, from the Caribbean there is a black cake um, I don't make it it's too involved but my mom um, knows somebody who makes it and she actually brought some over for Thanksgiving which was yummy and a couple of days ago I called her and said I just finished the last piece of it can you order some for Christmas so um, but first would be my bread pudding and then would be that black cake what is your favorite holiday cookie I don't have one and I know somebody said um, I think it was Lisa who said um, what sugar cookies can't stand it I don't like I don't like sugar cookies I don't like sugar on anything actually well I shouldn't say on anything I don't like sugar on top of things that gives it that crunch like on a muffin that ugh, no 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 can't do it and I don't like sugar sprinkled on my cookie or anything like that no so no I don't like sugar cookies <laughs> I told you this was gonna be kinda of boring um, does your family open gifts on Christmas Eve or Christmas Day well because we um, gather with my in-laws on Christmas Eve we do um, presents there with them and it's mostly for the for the kids and if we exchange anything with them I'm pretty sure they do their own opening again on Christmas Day 
um, and then with my family on Christmas Day. Do you decorate your tree alone or a family? Well, like I said, the kids haven't been very involved. If I ask them to start, they will start it and then I'll come in and it will be like half done or some here and nothing on this side. So pretty much I end up doing it myself. So I wasn't too gung-ho about doing it this year and then my husband said he was gonna, we'll see. Ah, where do you go on Christmas day? To my parents' house. Um, actually, we go mainly to my mom's, my parents' house, and then um, sometimes we alternate. We might go to my brother's house um, and do it there, but mostly we go to my mom's. What is your favorite holiday smell? Anything baking on the holidays? Um, mostly sweet smells, not, not really savory foods, just the, the, you know, pie in the oven or my bread pudding and oh, you can smell the butter in the air. Did I tell you I have a sweet tooth like really, really bad? I would give up sugar, I would give up uh, salt if I can, if I can have sugar, which is so bad. I know, I know it's bad. I eat like chips that are unsalted chips or unsalted pretzels, which my teammate calls like eating wood. I don't care. I like it. Sugar over salt. Um... Oh, I never called out the numbers, but I'm on the last one. What is your favorite thing to make during the holidays? And is it for yourself or for someone else? I don't have anything favorite that I make during the holidays. I always, the last few years, I've always said I'm not going to crochet or make anything for anyone. And then last minute I end up doing that. Um, right now, the only really um, yarn worthy people, uh, my mom, my mother-in-law, Dorian, um, my kids used to wear it, but not anymore, really. Um, but this year, my nieces asked for handmade, so that's pretty cool. But it's usually just my mom, my mother-in-law, and Dorian. He appreciates it still. So yeah, that's it. Pretty boring. Nothing, nothing really exciting that we do. Um, I'd rather, to be honest, just wake up late and stay home, and especially now, just crochet and knit and play with yarn, watch you guys on YouTube catch up then have to get out and go anywhere. So that is it, pretty eh. Um, so tag someone else. So from the few that I've seen, pretty much everyone's been tagged. So I tag everybody. I was gonna tag Claudia, but Z did that. Um, Summer's been tagged. I was gonna tag Angelia because she hasn't made a video and I figured this would be a good, um, good one just for her to pop in, but she's already been tagged. Um, so anybody who does videos, um, Vicky of Ice Flower. Um, who else? I can't think of anyone, so everybody, do it. It's just fun to see, and it's reminding me of things that we haven't done. I don't have tradition. I'm gonna make them have a tradition now. <laughs> anyway, that is it for me for now, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.